Well, at, at the time we felt franchising was a perfect compromise. Um, we'd done the corporate environment and we also had done the other extreme, which was a startup company where we had zero help. It allowed us to the, the freedom and flexibility to do our own thing, but also provided structure and processes that, uh, that could really help us be successful and also take some of the burden um, off being a, an entrepreneur with, you know, on your own. I like the franchise system, you know, someone else is doing all the uh, global research about, you know, what, you know, what you should be doing for operations, marketing, uh, how much inventory you should have. It would be very difficult, I think, to operate the same kind of store that I have on my own without the support of a, you know, a really good franchisor. Because it's a franchise, we that, that helped us make our decision because of the opportunity to have more stores. And once we figured out the system, it's, it's like making a pizza. Once you figure out how to make one great pizza, then you want to you want to make a hundred of them. The ease of another job is you're working nine to five, you go home and you forget about it. The, the ease or the joy of a franchise, owning your own franchise, is you get to see your business build. And it's been so exciting all of these years to see our business build. Being part of a franchise, we've got all the other owners that we're able to communicate with and to share ideas and to build on ideas. I might come up with something that I want to do in my store, but I don't know how to implement it. So I'm on the phone with one of the other owners saying, help me with this, or they're on the phone with me saying, help me with this. If we were a mom and pop shop independent, we'd never get that support through each other to start with. The reason these fr Windmark franchises are making it is because the majority of people involved with them are doing a good job and following the pattern so that people can be comfortable going to one wherever they're at and, and get same kind of similar results so it's one of the great benefits of franchising you know and since the majority of Plato's owners do a good job in maintaining their stores and, and the image of the business because you know we either make it or break it together in franchising. I often wonder how a, a uh, locally owned mom and pop store is able to uh, do everything that goes into uh, creating a great business without, a, without the support of a, of a franchisor. One day, my dad uh, sat next to a franchise owner, Plato's Closet owner, on a plane and um, got really excited and called me and said, what do you think about Plato's Closet? And I said, well, I shop at the one near school or when I, when I was at college. And he said, okay, well, what do you think about opening your own store? And I said, that sounds like an awesome idea. What do I do? And he said, go, you fly up to Minneapolis and you interview with the, the training team and see what you think. Fell in love with everything to do with the brand and the support and, um, and Windmark.